Hey, this is Mike with First Updates. Now we're in the Galileo Division with 179 Children of the Swamp coming off a dominant performance at the South Florida Regional where they picked up the win there. And uh, we're here with Dan and Alex. So we're going to kind of go through the robot a little bit. So Alex, can you um, kind of just take me through your climbing system and how that works? All right. So our climbing system runs off of three legs, two in front, one in back. The two in front are driven, connected to the drivetrain through a train that runs through the, uh, through the tube the whole time. The drivetrain, it's running constantly with it, so the chain moves as you move the wheels. And they're run with idlers inside, so that as it moves down, it stays under constant tension. We've got a set of surgical tubing and a constant force spring at the bottom that runs them. And then in back, they're ratcheted along so that we can release them however we want to wherever level, so that if we just want to bring it up a little bit, however we want to climb, we have control over that. And uh, so that's pretty much most of what I can think about. It's pretty fun. Uh, and uh, we, we thought of a real fun nickname for them because while we were at the shop, we were messing around one day, someone pointed out that it, it kind of looks like a giraffe when it's real up high. So we call them the giraffe legs when, when we're talking about them. It's just a little fun thing we do. Very cool. Nice. So, Dan, you're kind of just going to walk us through your, your intake mechanisms and how this all works and works together. All right. So uh, one of the main parts of our intake is how it's able to actuate in this gearing. Uh, it's all powered off of one single 775 Pro. Um, in the past, we've faced backlash with how we've uh, set up the gears. So what we did to avoid that this time is we press fit them. That avoided uh, that potential backlash and made it a lot uh, smoother and less um, less of that able uh, movement. So um, another part that you can see in here is uh, we have a sensor. And what that allows us to do is if we're holding a ball, it'll determine which positions we're using for when we're going to be scoring. Um, and otherwise it'll know which positions for with where we have a hatch. So that kind of uh, helps our driver have an easier time with uh, controlling. It makes it a lot smoother. Um, yeah, I think that's pretty much it on the intake. Well, guys, it's been fun watching you this season. Like I said, just that dominant performance. A little trouble at the Orlando Regional, but we got through that and, and bounced back and, and, and just won handily at uh, South Florida. So we appreciate your time. Good luck the rest of the way this weekend. We need your help to keep fun loud, live, and independent. Help us by visiting our Patreon to pledge your support at patreon.com forward slash first updates now. You can also support fun live on Twitch for a few bucks a month or by linking your Prime account for free and clicking subscribe. Thank you to all of our co-executive producers keeping fun loud, live, and independent.